We're in Mansfield. Mansfield, you say it because you've got the Mansfield accent. Mansfield. Hey, up me dock. Do you use that? No, I don't. Say you never that. say it me dock? No. Do you say, do you use the other one? The other one that Anne's uses, the blonde angel. What you're, did she say? You're right, chick. You're <laughs> right, chick. I know you're watching. I know you're watching, Ange. Did you say that? No, I don't. You're right, chick. No. No? Well, anyway, we're in Mansfield and we're going to head off to a place called the Tea Rooms, Titchfield Tea Rooms. I've been before. I've had a full English breakfast here. Have which, you? I, yeah, I like my full English breakfast. I haven't had one for a while, but I will be having another one. I'm feeling good now. So they do a ploughman's lunch here. I'm hoping they've got it on the menu today because I had a ploughman's lunch the other day at Jeremy Clarkson's farm at Diddley Squat. And uh, yeah, I enjoyed it, it was there. nice. Down in the Cotswolds, and it was nice. I've actually wanted to go there. Yeah, well they do full English breakfast here, they do ploughman's lunch. They also do, obviously, afternoon teas, which uh, I think you have to book in advance, but we're not gonna do that today. I'm gonna go for the ploughman's lunch. If they've got it on the menu, please let them have it on the menu. I love a ploughman's lunch. I love a ploughman's lunch. You're getting excited now, aren't you? I am, yeah. You're getting all happy about your ploughman's lunch. Yeah, a cup of tea as well. Although they do milkshakes though as well. And I like oh, a milkshake, if, if it's a good milk. Oh. We won't go about the other milkshake. No. We that don't one, mention that, that one. one. Might have put me off for life. Put you off for life. But I think these are good. I'm pretty sure the, the milkshakes here are pretty good. So uh, anyway, if you're new to the channel, like, subscribe and hit that little bell for notifications. And if you want some merch like this, you can get it down below. What other stuff have you got? What other stuff? I've got, I've got hoodies, I've got hats, I've got caps, I've got all sorts of down there as well. Yeah, down below. Can you do it? Down Oh, have you got baby tops? Have I got baby vests? You should start doing that. I don't know whether I've got baby tops. Anyway, <laughs> on that bombshell, my friends, let's go. Let's go. Now then, I'm going to ask her a question in a minute because I'm going, oh, I'm going to go for a ploughman's lunch. I'm betting she doesn't know, she, Paige, uh, doesn't know what a ploughman's lunch is. Uh, I can guarantee it. I shouldn't say she, my dad used to say, who's she? She's the, who, uh, anyway, I can't remember what it is. The, 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 you know what I mean, pop it in the comment section down below, but I'm going to ask her and I want you to tell me as well in the comment section down below what a ploughman's lunch consists of. Let's go and get her. Right, now then, what does, she won't know, what does a ploughman's lunch consist of? You're going to tell me, however, I'm going to make it a little bit more difficult because you're going to tell me the components of a ploughman's lunch while you're on one of these uh, exercise devices. We'll make it a bit more <laughs> so that you can't just think, I'm you know. I'm going to work out this morning. Well, you're going to work out again and you're yeah. going to work out also at the same time what a plowman's lunch consists of. Come on. Right, Paige, so I want to know exactly what, and it may change. You can tell me in the comment section down below what a plowman's lunch consists of. But first, I need you to get on here and uh, be working out at the same time. So this is going to be fun. Yeah, let's not fall on camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so go for it. What does a ploughman's <laughs> lunch consist of, Paige? Um, oh, this is like a weird quiz TV show there. <laughs> um, <laughs> wait, I'm just eating my hair. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's, let me just get my phone out, Google, now. <laughs> Go on. Che cheese and cheese? pickle. Pickle. Sandwiches. No, no sandwiches. No sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> no, doesn't consist of sandwiches. Cheese. Um, Cheese, pickle. Uh, yeah, pickle. Some Couple of... Walker's crisps on there. Uh, no, not really. Crisps don't really count, no. <laughs> right. Carry on, um, keep going. You can't, you can't, 
you got to get at least three before you can stop. Come on. Cheese. Uh, yeah, pickle. Tom tomato, tomato, tomato. Uh, I would say no with the breakfast no. lunch, but I may be wrong on that one. Uh, go on. Onion. Onion. Pickled onion. Pickled, pickled onion. onion. Yeah, yeah. Go on. Yeah. Go on. Now, uh, what's one of the major components of a of a ploughman's lunch? Come on, what would fill you up? I've said bread. Uh, you can have bread, yeah, but I mean that's sort of like an addition though as well. What's the main? Come on, the main component. Crackers. No, it comes from Melton Mowbray. I'll give you a clue. Pork. Pie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Go on, can you get any more? Um, no. I think we'd better leave it at that because you're no. probably going to be out of breath, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> right, so now I need you to tell me what a, what a ploughman's lunch consists of. Pop it in the comment section down below. Are there any differences on it? Can some things be on it and not? Does it differ uh, in different uh, parts of the UK or different parts of the world? Does it only actually exist in the UK? Can you have a ploughman's lunch anywhere else? Let me know all about a ploughman's lunch in that comment section. Let's get over there because hopefully they've got one on now. Right, so I've ordered I've ordered two ploughman's lunches, one with brown bread, one with white, because I don't know what Paige likes. Do you like brown or white? Brown. I should, uh, oh, you like brown, good, because I like white. There we go. So I've ordered two <laughs> ploughman's lunches, uh, a Fanta Zero for Paige there as well. Uh, I've ordered a strawberry milkshake and also two uh, tap waters. Now that came to a total of uh, £20 exactly. Um, I'm going to fold this over, there you go. Uh, so you can see a copy of the receipt there you go that's a copy of my contactless receipt 20 pounds exactly now we're gonna have a look at this um, plowman's lunch mark it out of 10 like we normally do remember i had a plowman's lunch at um diddly squat farm which is jeremy clarkson's farm i think I've got a fly in my mouth there um at jeremy clarkson's farm i can't remember exactly what that was i think it was about is it 14 pounds or something i can't remember you can pop it in the comment section down below and I enjoyed it, but a lot of people says, "Oh, you know, didn't want it in a dog bowl, etc." I'm gonna get. I'm gonna take a guess that this is gonna be a lot better, but we'll we'll see, and we'll reserve judgment. And uh, strawberry milkshake, I'm looking forward to. I've had water. I don't really drink diet uh, drinks anymore or pop or anything like that. I go for water and Yorkshire tea. So there we go. No alcohol for me anymore as well. And I've got to tell you, I feel so good for it. I'm really looking forward to this. A plowman's lunch in this weather fantastic and uh, Paige is going to have a plowman's lunch even though she doesn't know what it consists of. <laughs> I read it on the menu. Oh she read it on the menu. Now to the person that commented that I should be wearing tighter jeans. Um, well I've just had a baby and uh, I thought I'd wear them again for you. Yeah, I saw that page actually, and he also said that he needed a shave or something now, but what you have to remember about these people is, they are the kind of people that write on toilet walls, just remember that, so there we go, anyway. Yeah, they're probably not wrong, I mean, I probably might need a shave. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you might need a shave, oh, there we go. Get a wax. Oh, a wax, yes, a wax, get a wax. <laughs> Nothing wrong with the jeans though, apparently they're in fashion, so uh, what would you know? Go and stick to, stick to writing on toilet walls. Anyway, I'm looking forward to this, yeah, and I've got my milkshake as well, which is very nice. Cold, good, good milkshake. Hmm classic it's not like a ice cream one classic milkshake very nice right my friends so we have got the plowman's lunch here which consists of the pickle in there we've got some salad got some cheese got the bread there as well nice and fresh bread uh, got the eggs there 
little pork pie there as well. Got some ham there. Uh, tomato on here as well. I think I said that it didn't consist of a tomato, didn't I? You did, yeah. I did, so I might have made you pedal a little extra there. You've started already. I said just tuck in and get on with it. So before we go any further, take a closer look, my friends. Right, I'm not actually going to get a million angles on this for you today because I really, really want to enjoy this. It looks superb. But uh, first of all, we've got some cheese on here. We're going to go in for the cheese. There we go. Oh, yeah. That's good. Coleslaw there, which I'm going to decant. What does uh, that mean? What does decant mean? Yeah. It means uh, empty it. Right. Decant it. Um, right, there we go. Got some coleslaw on there. Um, nice bit of ham as well and that is a quality piece of ham oh yeah that is absolutely gorgeous it's like a christmas spread it's like a christmas spread but for summer yeah mm. really really nice i'm not going to talk anymore it's fantastic really really good i'm going to decant the uh, the pickle there as well Pop that on there. Pleasantly surprised. Pleasantly surprised. It's excellent, this is. Right. Salad nice and fresh. Spot on. We'll eat this, come back to you, and then we'll mark it out of 10. Absolutely fantastic. Mmm. Beautiful. Right, okay, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna wind this one up quick, right? I reckon, I reckon that was a 10 plus. Jeremy Clarkson, eat your heart out because I tell you what, you've got diddly squat on that ploughman's lunch. It was excellent, thoroughly enjoyed it. Great location, great staff, service was like that. They were on it, they were really busy in there and boom, it came out really quickly. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Great piece of ham. Pork pie was nice. Um, pork pie was nice. Pork pie was nice. Yeah. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Yeah. For me, it's a 10 plus. I'll put their details in the description down below. Come and visit them. What do you reckon? What's your score? Uh, a 10. Great location. Lovely staff. Uh, yeah, the service is great and the food, oh, amazing. Yeah, I'd definitely come again. There you go. Yeah. Especially if I'm paying. Yep, and that. We always end it on that note. We always end it on that note. And on that bombshell, my friends, make sure you hit that subscribe button, click the little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.